So this is Dan Steer at the ASTD 2014 International Conference and Exposition on the last day with Katie Stroud, who I just followed in a really awesome session. You were talking about story for learning. Uh, can you just remind us why that's important? Story is really important because people remember stories because when you tell a story, it activates more of the senses in the brain. And just the mere fact of more of the brain being used means it's more cemented within the brain. So right. if you want people to remember things, you should tell them a story. So do you want me as a trainer to be standing up telling stories all the time? Is that the point? That would be awesome. <laughs> but it needs to be relevant to the content. It needs to fit with what it is you're trying to get across. Yeah, okay. So I start from my kind of learning objectives and then I want to develop a story that I can keep using across the span of the learning in different ways. And I'm glad I came to your session because you told me how to do that. So tell my friends how to do that. <laughs> yeah, so there's not a lot of information on exactly how to do that. And the way that you do that is you simply take the elements of story, your background, your setting, your conflict and, and climax and the beginning, middle, and end. We need to figure out how your point, your, your instructional material, the, the details that go into that, we need to fill that into that elements of story. Use it as a template. Mm -hmm. And then use. Uh, we need to address uh, how your characters uh, fit into that story, how they suffer from having to make changes in their lives and, and, and move on. And when we put that all together, we come up with a story that the brain remembers. Okay, yeah. And so I went through with uh, your, your session, kind of workshopping that, thinking about a specific problem that I had, uh, and defining it all. And then so I've got my basic story in mind, and then what should I do with that in my training? Whatever I want? Whatever you want. What, whatever you want. Uh, you need to just take that, and, and it's a source of inspiration. And what you're really after, in, in the end, maybe it doesn't look like a story, but your brain will receive it as a story because it has a beginning, a middle, and an end. It gives the brain all the parts that it needs to put everything together. Yeah. Well, I, um, I'm having to move that around for the security guys behind. I've uh, been working on my story, so I've also blogged your session. And then I might do another post just saying, well, here's the kind of basic idea I've got. And uh, maybe I'll send it over to you. You tell me what you think. That would be awesome. Katie, uh, thank you so much. Good luck with the next few weeks and, and, and all the other big things. Uh, thank you so much for your time. Thank you for asking me.